Hey Internet, Eric here. Um, if you're watching my videos in order, I just opened up or I just did an unboxing video from Milk Creek Entertainment and I got a lot of crap. Some good, but mostly crap. Now I'm going to do an unboxing video courtesy of Channel Downstar. I only got a couple things here. I was going to do them together, but decided against it since the Milk Creek. Um, the Mill Creek gift box or whatever the fuck you would call it was quite large and hopefully this will be a happier video I can already tell because Roger or Ch Channel Downstar so far hasn't really all, um, uh, done anything wrong taste wise sending me stuff um, he, I've got a playlist basically I, Roger could have his own playlist for unboxing stuff so Long story short, we're going to open up these two packages, courtesy of Channel Donstar, see what I got, and I'm pretty sure they're already going to be better than the uh, Mill Creek Entertainment stuff. So, let's open this up. No idea what these are. Got them from Amazon. I don't feel any... I don't look at this. I don't see what it is. Is there anything on the inside? Receipts? Oh. You can't see the address. Okay, good. We got... Ooh, Wreck. I know Roger wants me to review this. I wanted to review it for my uh, Is It Worth the Hype series, and this is definitely going to be on it. And per Roger's request, I will watch it in the Spanish language version because lots of times in the English language version, they butcher it. Like, um, I'm a big fan of Shaolin Soccer. And I have the Mandarin version, which actually has added scenes, so this might be a lot different. Um, anyways, beautiful TV reporter and her cameraman are doing a routine interview at a local fire station when an imaginary emergency call comes in. Accompanying the firefighter to a nearby apartment, the news team begins recording the blood-curdling screams coming from inside the elderly woman's unit. After authorities seal off the building to contain the threat, the news crew... The firefighters and residents are trapped to face a lethal terror inside. With the cameras running, nothing may survive, but the film itself includes a making of featurette. Um, I've seen Quarantine. I thought Quarantine was decent. I've heard this is, this is obviously the original, and I've heard this blows it out the fucking water. So I'm very, very excited to see this. Thank you, Roger. It's already halfway better than my Mill Creek Entertainment unboxing. It's probably going to be a short one. I only got another thing in one box. Don't know what it is. But we will see. Make sure I don't look. No messages. We have... Ha ha! Direct 2. Fear Revisited. Um, highly anticipated sequel to one of the scariest films of all time, Rec 2, picks up 15 minutes from where we left off, taking us back to the quarantine apartment building where the terrifying virus runs rampant. That's not a spoiler, I already know what's going on, Roger. What they find lies beyond the scope of medical science, a demonic nightmare more terrifying than anyone could possibly imagine. Deleted scenes, behind the scenes, walk through, on tour... It is in uh, Spanish, so Roger will be happy about that. I know Roger said these are like one of his favorite uh, group of films, I guess, a series of films. And Rec 3. Genesis, You May Kiss the Bride. That's kind of cool looking. I like, I like that. I like the just the cover of this. really look cool with the colors. Um... Uh, Clara and Koto's wedding unfolds through the lens of a video camera that captures their beautiful ceremony and a festive reception that follows. But the camera also bears uh, unblinking witness to the shocking reality of chaos and horror that ensues after a virus spreads through the reception, transforming the wedding guests into something inhuman and forcing the newlywed couple into terrifying fight for their lives. Separated amid the mayhem, the newlywed couple discover the true meaning of the vow till death do us part. Deleted scenes and outtakes. Um, and it's in Spanish. Well, there you go. This is all directed by the same guy. Paco Plaza. 
Paco Plaza. Paco. Cool. So I have the, we'll do this like this. I have the three rec films. I think there's a fourth one. Don't know. But this is cool. Thank you, Roger. Like I said, I've been wanting to see at least the first one for the longest time. And even way before I was doing my, like, is it worth the hype stuff? So, but now I don't have to buy it. Thank you very much. Um, and then the next two, however you want to do it, whatever. Thank you again for that. Um, I'll probably do these, this for Is It Worth the Hype and just do regular reviews for this or I'll at least review just the first one. I really like that cover. The, the, the tone, the, just the way it looks, it's really cool. Yeah, so this is going to be a short ass video considering that I only got three things and not much to talk about because I don't know much about the movies other than monsters attacking people. Wreck 2, Wreck, Wreck 3, whatever. Thank you again, Roger. Much appreciated. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing all three of those films. Um, that's it. Probably one of my shortest videos ever. Um, thank you for watching. Please check out my buddy Roger's channel over at Channel Donstar. Um, uh, just throw him a sub. Uh, throw him likes on his videos or whatever. Comment below. Just check out his stuff. He's a really cool guy. Um, knows his movies. I don't know how else to show your channel, Roger, but check out channel Donstar. Roger, tell Roger Eric sent you. Um, thanks again. I'm babbling. Um, I'll just say cheers, and I really can't wait to watch these. Thanks again, buddy.